Hey, welcome back to the January house. This is Mike. Thanks for checking in. Today's video is a what sold video. Some items that sold recently in my stores. So let's jump into it. All right, first up is this Stephen King book. This is Salem's Lot. I got this in a storage locker in a big tote full of other books. And you can see it's got a little bit of damage on the dust jacket, some wear, some tears. Uh, but I put it in the store and it sold for $24.61. I was running a sale plus shipping. All right, next up is this Mitsubishi VCR. And this thing was really good condition. It had the original box. I got it at the live auction that I've been going to. I think I paid $10 for it. And just a note, I always put a blank VHS tape uh, with my VCR lots when I sell them. I think it helps a little bit. Blank new VCR tapes, you can usually pick them up pretty inexpensively. I always add one uh, when I make a listing for a VCR. I did really well with this one. I sold it for $67.96 plus shipping. All right, next is a lot of two hunting licenses from Pennsylvania. These are vintage hunting licenses. I picked a whole shoe box up of these at my buddy John's estate sale. Uh, so I have a number listed. I have many more. I need the list, uh, but a good sale for two small pieces of paper, $15 with free shipping. All right, next is an item that really surprised me. This is a lot of five votive candles. They're new. Uh, never used and I got them at the live auction that I go to just in a big box of Christmas things and I lotted them together and I sold them for $25 with free shipping. All right next up is an item that didn't sell for much money but is a milestone item for me. This is a Ninja Blender lid just replacement part just the lid only. The reason why I included this in my what sold video is that this item is the last piece from my very first storage locker that I ever bought. So I bought this locker probably two years ago. I bought it online at one of the online auction sites. It was a five by five unit. I thought I'd take a chance. It looked terrible from the pictures, but I saw this Ninja Blender box. I wasn't sure if the blender was actually inside or not, but I saw the box and some other items. So I thought I'd take a chance. I paid a whopping $10 for this unit and the blender was inside. So I parted it out. But this lid was the last piece from that first storage locker that I ever bought. You can see in the picture, I didn't even have a photo cube uh, back then. I took the picture on my dining room table with the background. Looks pretty good though. Maybe I'll take more pictures on the dining room table. Uh, but this finally sold, so that locker is done. I sold it for $12 plus shipping. All right, next up is a vintage Mark Martin t-shirt. And it came with a Mark Martin NASCAR card, trading card that was autographed. I got it from my buddy John at one of his estate sales. I forget how much I paid, a couple bucks, maybe $2, maybe $4. Uh, and it sat in my store for a long time, but it finally sold for $29.95 plus shipping. All right, next up is another book. This is a learning 2D development, like computer programming book. I wasn't really sure if this book would actually ever sell. I got it in a storage locker, so I had very little cost into it, uh, but I put it up on eBay. It sat for a long time, but I finally sold it for $16 plus shipping. All right, next are a couple empty beer bottles. I sold to one individual. I got these in a storage locker as well. I actually have a case of the one beer bottle, so I have many more of the FNS beer bottles to sell if anyone's interested out there. <laughs> uh, but. Uh, these sold together to one person for $10 plus shipping. All right, next up is an angel figurine. The angel looks like it's dressed like uh, in a boating theme, like maybe it's the captain. I'm not really sure. I got these at the live auction. I got a number of these figures. I paid $5 for probably 14 uh, angel figures, various types. Uh, and I've made over $100 on that sale profit since that purchase. So uh, I'm pretty excited. This one sold for $19.95 plus shipping. And finally, I sold this Dino Riders gun accessory part, just this little piece. It was probably about this big. If you're familiar with my channel, you know that I buy big lots of action figures and accessories, and then I part them out. I do pretty well with them. Uh, this one sold for $8 plus shipping. So that's all I have. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit the thumbs up button for me. Leave me a message in the comments and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more great videos. Thanks.